Um, well, toughest series so far. So we played three days in Gaul and two days here. The toughest five days, certainly. Um, it's, uh, it's been a lesson, of course, and one that I'm sure we'll learn going forward. Um, look, we played two spinners in, um, in Gaul and we got 20 wickets, but we didn't make enough runs. We felt like the batting was a bit short. Um, so I think you would understand when it comes to finding the right balance in, in our team, all the different um, situations that we need to go through to make sure we got, we got the right balance. Uh, we thought we would play an extra batsman. Um, looking at the surface out there, um, before the game it looked a lot more abrasive than the goal surface. We felt like we would get a bit of reverse swing and then you ask yourself the question, who would they rather face, another spinner or would they rather face our seamers? So we felt we would back our seamers um, on the surface, hoping that, um, like I said, the abrasiveness of the surface give us a little bit of reverse swing to work with with our three fastest bowlers and that was a decision really. Um, you know, we've got We've got very capable batsmen. We've got world-class batsmen in our dressing room, um, and they're hurting at the moment as well. Obviously, they haven't they haven't performed to the way, to the level that um, that we expect or the level that they've performed um, in the past, even in, in Sri Lanka in the past. You know, like so Hashim and, and Dean Elgar, especially, have got runs here. Uh, we've got a couple of newbies as well, a couple of youngsters that are getting their their first or second taste of of subcontinent cricket and trying to understand what that's all about. Um, you know, and, and at the end of the day, we just got to put our hands up and say that Sri Lanka in these conditions have been far too good for us. It's all the spinners. I mean, all the spinners have created a threat. Um, it, and it's not just the ones that get the wickets, but the ones that, um, you know, Hiraf hasn't got many wickets, um, but he's bowled also very economically as well. And, and they create pressure. And they bowl together very well. And they create, they create a lot of pressure. Um, the, the guys around the bat uh, also created um, a bit of theatre and, and, and some pressure. And we've not been, we've not been good enough to deal with it. Um, Crystal, I would, I would think it's a combination of both. Um, obviously, from a, you know, like I said, from a technical point of view, the, the accuracy of the Sri Lankan spinners, and they're not, they're not spinning every ball, but the accuracy um, with which they're bowling um, means that they're challenging our techniques, and then some spin, some doesn't spin. Uh, and, and therefore then that, that becomes a mental battle of which balls to play, which balls to leave, when to go forward, when, when, to, when not to go forward and stuff like that. And those are the challenges that um, the, the Sri Lankan spinners have posted for us. And um, like I said, in, in a, in a two-test series like this, you know, it, we don't have enough time to, uh, and we haven't really found those answers yet, you know, but there'll be more subcontinent tours, you know, and I, and I just hope that we are, um, learning those lessons, obviously the very tough lessons to learn when a series is going on and you're not playing very well and you're losing the way we are, but it's still tough. Uh, I would still hope that we're learning those lessons that will make us better going forward. The one thing I, I picked up very early when I came to when I came to South Africa was this, this, this um, the notion of protea fire and what it meant to represent uh, the proteas, you know, and, and I, will, I will still be drawing on that. Um, in the dressing room, certainly tonight and tomorrow, to say that you know the, the thing about the proteo is that we we fight till the very end, and that's what we're gonna we're gonna try and do over the the duration of the game. I'm not a fan of two test series. I think um, you know three test matches is more a fair, a fair reflection of um, you know if, if a team comes comes here and they lose the first test, um, you know in 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 tough conditions that they're trying to get used to the conditions and everything. I don't think they have enough time to get back into the series. Likewise, if if Sri Lanka came to South Africa, you know, I would I would still prefer that it be a three test match series. If you lose the first test match, you still got two more games to try and get back into the series. If you lose the first test match here, the series is gone already. You know, at the end of the day, we're playing to win series, not draw or lose series, obviously. I think he's, um, he, he looks very calm at the crease. He's obviously very, um, you know, assured in defence. Uh, he's got a very solid defence, and then when the ball is there to attack, he attacks it. But he attacks it in his in his areas. He looks to me like he plays to his strengths a lot, um, and we've not been able to to sort of exploit the, what, what we saw before the series as weaknesses. We've not been able to exploit them because, again, perhaps the nature of the surfaces, but the way he's also played, he's played very well. You know, at the start of every session, we say this is the most important. Um, and and it's, it's not always gone. It's not always gone that way. But tomorrow, you know, the, the one thing I've always said 
uh, and, and I'll, I'll be emphasizing is we can't stand around in the field and wait for them to, to declare. We still have to go out and try and get wickets and try and, um, and produce uh, the sort of cricket that I guess our fans would expect to see from us, you know, and, um, and that's the important thing. So tomorrow the first session is still the most important session for us. Let's try and see if we can get a breakthrough. You know, they've, they've got obviously a lot of runs on the board, so there can be a little bit of a, a carefree, if you like, attitude from, from their players, from their batters. But we still have to make sure that we are, at the end of the day, professional in our approach to, to, um, to try and see how far, how far we can take the day.